News 8 at 5.30 in high definition continues. Technology is making it easier for doctors to stabilize your heart in a crisis. Earlier, I spoke with Dr. Tim Malins, and he explains why doctors and their patients are increasingly relying on heart monitors. Tonight, we're talking about wearable heart monitors. These are devices that monitor heart rhythm disorders and document episodes of dizziness, for example. Um, Dr. Tim Malins, can you give us an example of the kinds of monitors we're talking about? What are they? Are they watches? Are they? Do you insert them in, under the skin? What is it? Yeah. So. One of the hard, hardest things that when patients come to a cardiologist say is, is palpitations or are sometimes intermittently I feel a racing heart. And that's something that you can't just catch there because it happened sometime in the past. Mm -hmm. And so with some people who will come in and say this, we can give them a monitor and there's two types of monitors. I'll put them in two categories to make them fairly simple. And they're wearable monitors and it's, it's sort of like a 25, 24 hour electrocardiogram. So it's continually monitoring the heart and there are little electrodes that you put on and a little box that you can put in the in your pocket mm -hmm. or that you can tie around your waist. Or there's some that if you're going to do it for longer that we can actually do it for 30 days and where it's not continually recording because we've run out of space where you can trigger it. When you have an event, you can do it. And so basically they're just EKG machines that are continuously recording or triggered to record should you have episodes. Are there any risks associated with wearing a monitor? No. Uh, in fact, I find them very beneficial just because they can be a little cumbersome, I guess, maybe, and, and you can't do some of the activities. Some you can even wear in the shower now. Right. Uh, but they're very, very beneficial for us because I can't go back in time and see something. But what I can do is put on this, uh, this instrument that will monitor the electricity in your heart, see exactly what's happening. And then when you have one of the episodes, you, you push a button. And then it comes through with satellite and then comes right to my office right. and I can see exactly what was going on. Yeah, and the technology is so amazing these days that they, they keep changing. Finally, do monitors actually administer any kind of treatment if it detects an abnormality in heart rhythm, for example? So there is one type of monitor and this is something uh, that is that is given uh, to people who've had a heart attack and their heart is weak and it's what we call a wearable defibrillator. We've talked about defibrillators before is where a lot of them are implanted. Mm -hmm. This is something while you're waiting to see whether the heart improves that you can wear and it's like a little vest that you wear and if your heart goes into an abnormal rim rhythm which could possibly be life-threatening it will shock you out of it just as if the other one did. Yeah, well, keep us posted on the changing technology. It's year to year. It really is oh, pretty yeah, amazing. Absolutely. All right, Dr. Tim Malins, thank you very thank much. Thank you. And to see this story and more segments on your heart and you, go to our website, rochesterhomepage.net.